Hi there. Today I want to show you some of the uh, recent changes we've done to the Jakarta EU webpage. We are constantly improving it and uh, trying to make it easier to navigate and uh, find relevant information there. So I'll just share my screen and uh, we'll uh, take it from there. So there, this is the Jakarta EU webpage. Uh, and as you see, it, it's a lot of, of many items and buttons there. And what we're currently doing is to remove some of these and just make it more intuitive where to go to find things. And uh, as you probably are familiar with, Eclipse uh, Foundation usually are organized by projects. Uh, but as with uh, Jakarta E, we're thinking more of specifications and the projects producing the specifications. So the natural way, uh, way of entry to Jakarta E is to click on the specifications. And here we can see all the specifications that are part of the Jakarta E platform. Uh, and uh, if, if we click it, uh, for example, beam validation here, this is what we've added recently. Uh, you can see we have the project web link here and we have the website uh, link here. So if, if I go click on the website, you will see I'm taken externally out to the beam validation uh, web page. And uh, likewise, if I click on the project page, I will get to the Eclipse project that is producing this uh, specification. And if I wanted to, to kind of add the uh, external web page to my specific uh, project, you can see the same link is here. This will take me to the beamvalidation.org web page. And the way I add it to this project is that I go in and edit the project information and uh, if I scroll down a little here, you'll see uh, a section called links and documentation. I can click on this one and I can add the uh, external web page or the uh, collaboration site that I'm using for my particular project. So to, uh, uh, to repeat this, in, in your project, uh, you, you will have um, a, a link to the project and to the web page if you uh, define it. If we go and click at some of the others, you can see that the platform project, we have uh, this set up for us. Uh, some other uh, specifications may or may not have it. All of them have a link to the project, which is the, where you manage the, uh, the uh, project. But as you see, the activation doesn't have a external web page. And if there is a external web page for Jakarta activation, or you want to create one, you just do it and you add it by navigating to the project page. So you can see here that the natural way of, of uh, navigating to uh, find information about the specifications is the specification entry point. So that was a short tip for today and I hope you enjoy uh, navigating and exploring the Jakarta EE webpage.